Hi, in today's episode, I'll show you how to install Django on a Namecheap server using cPanel. Let's start by selecting or searching for Setup Python app. Next, we create a new application. We choose the Python version. I'm selecting version 12. Enter a name, which will be the address of our application on the server. A virtual environment is created for us, which we will use later. Our application operates at the specified URL. Let's see what files were created for our application. Passenger WSGI is the application startup file. Let's move to the terminal. If we don't have a terminal in advanced tools, we need to enable SSH access and manage shell. Then, we copy our path and the created environment with Python 12. We can check that we are in our application folder. Next, we create a Django project in the same folder. Okay, maybe let's install Django first. Now we create the Django project. After refreshing, we see that a folder named blog with Django files has been created. The next step is to change the WSGI path of our application to the Django file. This file is located in the blog folder and is simply called WSGI.py. We change the path. The application entry point remains the same. We restart and get internal server error 500. The problem is with the IMP module. The error message indicates that the IMP module is not found. This is because the IMP module has been deprecated since Python 3.4 and removed in Python 3.10. If you're using Python 3.10 or later, you'll need to use the importlib module instead.
We change the contents of the file and restart the folder. We get another problem. This time it's related to a disallowed host. The solution to this problem is simple. We just need to add our domain to Django settings. Another restart. And everything works. We can enjoy the latest version of Django 5.0. If the video was helpful, be sure to comment and give a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments what other topics you want to see on the channel. Until next time.